now and guys that yeah it was Renson and today I'm going to Florence with my mom I'm really really excited because <laughs> it sounds pretty random but um I've just seen so many like videos about a sandwich place there and it looks so so good i'm really really excited to go to florence and see all the beautiful things there but i'm also really excited to find that sandwich place and just munch on the good good sandwiches that they're making there i hope they're good though but um i'll see you in florence bye all right we are finally here in florence with my mom of course and it's around 32 degrees right now so it's pretty pretty hot here compared to Denmark. It's crazy. I literally pray for God that I can get a tan this time because I almost didn't get a tan last time. I was like at a very hot place because I wasn't greased in the last time and I just didn't get a tan at all. It's crazy. So I hope that I can get a tan within these four days that I'm here in Florence. So I'm hoping for that. We are finally in Central Florence. I'm starving. What about you? Yes, Varen, but we are going to find our apartment. But I mean, we're going to get something to eat first, right? Because I'm, I'm not going to get my chicken butt tra uh, craving again from last video. No way. Do you want to try um, chicken butt? <laughs> no, I think I'm good, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Do you pronounce that? Stupci ilio di piti. Something like that. I think it's so interesting, like, especially for me, because I'm a big, like, building guy. I just think, like, every building here just looks like something that Michelangelo has, like, carved. They look, like, so beautiful, and I'm in love with the place, and, you know, I just came by the airport, so I'm just, like, shocked by how beautiful everything already is. I'm reading the uh, menu right now, but it's only in Italian, and I don't understand. And my mom just says, like, just order something, just order something. No, I want to know what I'm ordering. I can just order a um, tequila lette al pomodoro fresco e sipo ele calamelate. Like what? Quattro hey, leoni! Quattro oh, leoni! So, posso ordinare a uh, uh, roast beef con verdura al forno? Yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> Hai detto bene. Posso ordinare roast beef con verdure al forno? I have no idea what I have ordered, but um, let's try it. Do I put it on the bread? Do we just eat it? I think they need uh, Italians. Damn. This is crazy good. The meal was so so good. A lot like different compared to like Danish and maybe also Taiwanese meals. I don't really feel that I'm like stuffed now, but I still feel like good. It tastes really good. It doesn't like roast beef. If I got that, I would probably have been pretty stuffed by now. <laughs> This place looks pretty sketchy. But my mom says it's just pretty Italian. What? No way. What do they have upstairs? <laughs> Why do they have this? Like, what? Scary stuff. I like it weird. <laughs> We're gonna head out now to go on a voucher. Let's go. Of course, we're not going to Italy without tasting some good pink chilling. I got lemon and I got chocolate. Mm. It's pretty good. I think we've got enough pink chilling, right? <laughs> I do one more. Yeah, we're gonna go eat some good sandwiches now at one of the most high rated sandwich places here in Firenze. So that's gonna be really, really interesting. Taste one. Nice little tip one. Thanks, bro. <laughs> Oh, 
All right, it was so awesome filming there. I ordered La Medicina and it contains roasted ham, fracino, cheese and mushrooms. So let's try it. You like it? Mm -hmm. All right, let's try it. That's so good. Especially like when you get into the cheese, the flavors just mix so much better together. You guys should try it. Oh. It's probably one of the best sandwiches that I've ever tasted so far. The other one that I bought is called El Pinocchio, something like that. And it contains Toscan ham and goat cheese and mushrooms. So let's try it. It's also really good. I would probably rate this a bit higher than the other one that I got. What would you rate the sandwich from Wu Hao Tzu to Wak Hao Tao Hao Tzu? Wak Hao Tao Hao Tzu means really, really good. And Wu Hao Tzu means it's really, really bad. Mine sandwich was Wak Hao Tao Hao Tzu. Yeah, right. I think my sandwich was 9.9, 81. Ah. My sandwich was also Wak Hao Tao Hao Tzu, both of them. But the one that I liked the most was the second one. No heel. I was actually like scared about eating the goat cheese. I don't know why it just sounds like super sketchy, but it actually tastes really, really good with the combination of the mushroom and the uh, Toscan ham. I wasn't like a big fan of the uh, ham from the first one because it's just too much. The like Toscan ham just tastes a lot better, but it was Wakao Tao Hao here. Hello. Hello. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. Okay. Hi guys, everybody. From Italy. I was looking for a way to look like a real Italian. Can you help me with that? Of course. Oh, Let's shit. see what we can do. It something in linen, I think. You know, Italian usually wears linen, especially in the summer. So we can find something. Okay, awesome. So what do you think that could suit me? For sure, a linen shirt, definitely. And usually we have it also with the short sleeves. But here in Italy, usually we wear just the one with the long sleeve. Also to go to the beach, for example, right? right? So one of these we have with a classic color, but not too much classic, a little bit more casual. So now you have just to choose which one you like better. And then we have some linen pants. I think something also short, why not? Okay. You can wear it with a, a nice long shirt. Nice. Like this. Yeah, I think I'll maybe try this. Oh, okay, large. That should be fine, maybe. I think extra large. Italian extra sizes, large. they are usually smaller, you oh, know. And a, a short, for sure. So, choose a, a white shirt, so I think. Or beige, or... Uh, oh, right. With white goes everything. Right. Right. Maybe not not white, you looks like a, a nice cream man, you know what I mean. <laughs> or, uh, yeah, one of these colors here, I think, would be fine. Or also, one with the stripes, why not? Right. Buongiorno. Oh, perfect. <laughs> I don't feel Italian right now. No, but <laughs> it's just one thing. Oh, you miss one button. No, maybe. shit, really. <laughs> oh, but, but the style is really good. Yeah. Okay. What do you think? Yeah. I feel like maybe I need another, like, a different shirt, maybe. Okay. Try this. Thanks. Try this. <laughs> now I turned into a real Italian. That bro from the shop made, made me into a real Italian. Me and my mom are gonna go home now. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Yo, good morning. I'm standing right out of Palazzo Vecchio, one of the old town halls here in Florence. Let's just go in there. Everything has been carved out of stone. That's just so absurd to like think about. We are now out here at the cathedral of Santa Maria del Fiore. Also a funny fact about this cathedral is that the marble church of Copenhagen is actually inspired by this cathedral right behind me. The dome was actually, they started building the dome in 1426 and they finished the dome in 1436. So it took them 10 years to build this dome. So I don't think it's possible for us to get into the church or into the cathedral because there are like thousands of people just waiting outside. So we're gonna just enjoy the uh, view from outside. I'm sorry, guys. So my mom and I have just been out eating dinner at a fantastic place. It's called Pizium. And 
the pizza was just so, so good there. So I couldn't help myself. So I bought another pizza. I'm gonna taste here. I didn't have my camera on me when I was out eating. So I thought, why not? I can just eat another pizza because, I mean, I'm hungry. Let's see the pizza. This pizza got some prosciutto on it, of course, mozzarella, and some Montasio cheese flakes. And I'm really, really excited to taste this pizza. The other pizza that I just ate was just so immaculate. I have never tasted a pizza that good before, so I have like crazy, crazy high hopes or like high expectations for this pizza too. Let's dig in and rate it. But before I start eating the pizza, I need to open a Hugemona. And of course, I'm not sponsored by Monster, but Monster, please sponsor me in the future. Because I can't keep spending my money on so many monsters. So um, I would be very, very thankful if you would sponsor me. <laughs> Let's taste the pizza now. Oh my gosh. This is like so much better than me. One that I just got from the restaurant. Oh my god. Okay, guys. I think this pizza, um, do something else. <laughs>